and looking at the support the faculty gave me here, I decided to continue my journey in Akash to prepare for JEE mains and advanced. Akash was actually recommended to me by my uncle who said they had a very good JEE main and advanced and foundation program. Hello friends, my name is Anish Shastri. I joined Akash in 10th grade for the foundation course and stayed here for 2 years to prepare for JE mains and JE advanced. The fun year I stayed in foundation course, I managed to get 97.8% in my ICSC board results. And looking at the support the faculty gave me here, I decided to continue my journey in Akash to prepare for JE mains and advanced. Akash was actually recommended to me by my uncle who said they had a very good J main and advanced and foundation program. So in 10th grade, I always liked the subjects of maths and physics and was also interested in coding. So I asked my father, who was also a software engineer, that I wanted to become an engineer like him and what should I do to become an engineer. My father told, though JE is a very tough and competitive exam, if you want to get the best colleges and become one of the best engineers, you have to prepare for JE. That was when I decided that I wanted to prepare for JE and go to IIT Madras CSE. So my preparation followed three stages. The first stage was to be thorough with the concepts. You learn about the concept during classes, then revise the same concepts after the classes and before the next class you ask doubts about the concepts to make sure you are thorough with the concepts before moving on to the second stage which is solving questions. Solving questions gives you an idea about the chapter that studying the concepts won't. So it is best to solve as many questions as you can. Third stage is to write the exam and do the analysis for the exam. If I were to say 70% of the preparation comes through studying and solving questions, 30% is always about having the right exam mentality. So have practice test that Akash shows such as AI, ATS, FTS and Archive were very useful to me and are very important for preparing for JE. So the main challenges I faced in my preparation to JE was committing too many silly mistakes. During tests I realized that I commit a lot of silly mistakes which wouldn't happen normally. I would never make those mistakes normally. After analysis I feel demotivated like how did I make such mistakes. And the way I fixed them was giving a lot of tests. After you give a lot of tests, your mind eventually becomes accustomed to those tests. So you don't make as many silly mistakes. Test just feels like a normal session of solving questions. Now my low phase was during the start of archive series, I got pretty low scores. This was for the same reason I mentioned committing too many silly mistakes. I didn't really feel like giving up. I decided to give more archive tests and by the end I improved significantly on my scores. So the thing about the last month before exam is you've already learned through all the concepts and you've solved plenty of questions. So what is left is giving a lot of practice tests to develop the exam mentality. Akash helped me in this region because it had a lot of practice tests before one month before the exam such as FTS and archive tests. These tests helped me develop the mentality required for the exam and also helped me with time management. While writing this test it, I realized that the best way for me to attend the paper is to give physics first with 40 to 45 minutes on physics, spend 30 to 45 minutes on chemistry and leave the rest for maths because maths papers are usually lengthy. My parents and teachers assisted me in every step of the journey I made towards GE. My teachers always used to motivate me whenever I feel down after an exam. And my dad, regardless of how busy his schedule was or what family gathering was there would always come to visit me every week and to check on how I was doing. He also used to check all my test results and comment on how I was doing based on them. Regardless of J, I think discipline is a very important aspect of life. Motivation doesn't last very long and if you want to achieve your goals, it is important to stay disciplined and set goals for yourself every day. I used to set goals for myself every day, checking how much I want to do how much I need to study during this day and what exam I need to give and how much analysis I need to do. And doing this helped me stay organized, put effort every day properly and ended up giving me a better result. My main advice for GA aspirants 
is to not to think of JE as a very tough exam. It's just another exam and if you put in effort every day, you will be able to crack it. What is important is that you do not miss any classes, do not miss any tests, always take care of your health and do not be afraid to ask your teacher's doubts. And if you do this every day, put in effort every day, JE exam is not a very tough exam. I wish you all the very best.